Hello to all students. In this video lecture, we are going to discuss a structure which is known as book lungs. Book lungs are specialized respiratory structures which are found in animal kingdom in phylum Arthropoda. And in phylum Arthropoda, there are certain insects like arachnids, like spiders, scorpions, and some other marine or freshwater arthropods they use book lungs for respiration so let's discuss this structure and its function in detail so i have already made a diagram for you so this is a diagram of a spider which belongs to arachnids and which belongs to phylum arthropoda so in the cross section you can see blood circulatory system of this insect this is a heart which pumps blood. The blood of these insects is usually composed of hemolymph, which is distributed from different parts of the body. And one blood vessel takes this hemolymph or blood towards a structure which is known as book lung, which is located on the ventral surface of the body. So I have taken this book lung uh, out and enlarged it so that we can study it in detail so this book lung is composed of a membrane which acts like a, a balloon or act like a space the inside space between this membrane is known as atrium in this atrium there are leaf like structures membrane like structures which are known as lamella as you can see in this diagram the red color of the shape of the lamella this is lamella and when there are many lamella this 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 then these are known as lamellae lamellae of lungs because this is a lung which is known as book lung and inside this lung there are thin membranes which are known as lamellae between these two lamellae there are there is a space which is known as interlaminar air space these lamella are kept separated by rakers like structure which are present between two lamellae. These uh, lungs are called book lungs because they look like the pages of a book. In the book there is no space between the pages but right over here as you can see this is just like a page of a book. These are lamellae and in between there is a air spaces. This lung is associated outside the body with the help of a pore like structure which is known as spiracle which is a part of tracheal system of the insects. This book lung also is associated with certain muscles which help to contract the lungs and move the air in and out of the lungs. So when air or water enters inside the lungs, so I am taking the example of air because I am taking the example of a spider which lives on terrestrial conditions. So when water enters inside the lungs, this water or air, sorry, air moves into the interlaminar spaces between the lamellae of the lungs. On the other side, blood is coming which is known as blood flow. And as you know that blood is hemolymph, hemolymphs contain waste material, waste gases. So when blood flows into the uh, lamellae of the lungs and air moves in between the spaces of the lamellae, there is a gaseous exchange taking place right over here with the help of diffusion. Oxygen diffuses inside the blood while CO2 and waste material diffuses outside the, out into the air. And this mechanism also known as counter current mechanism. So in this way, gaseous exchange takes place. Oxygen diffuses in the blood is transported to all parts of the body while the waste material which waste gases like CO2 is removed from the blood into the air and into the body outside the body. So in this way, book lungs are specialized respiratory organ which are found in special insects belonging to phylum arthropoda and these lungs are known as book lungs because 
this lungs contain lamellae which looks like the pages of a book so that's all for today and hopefully see you in the next lecture until then bye